Yo, 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 what's going on out there, universe? It's your boy! Hellation, a.k.a. Fast and Sith, bringing you another Sith vlog. Welcome to... And thank you for joining me, this Sith Lord. And thank you for taking the time out to watch this video. What have we learned from this video, ladies and gentlemen? That Quest Bar's chocolate, whatever chocolate they use in their formula, I mean, and I know I sat up here and said I like dark chocolate, but that shit, that's like the most bitterest, nastiest, like it's like chocolate sludge it's i mean it's just it's disgusting it overpowers your palate and it's just ugh. so the good the bad and the best so the quest bar's best flavors to me are um peanut butter supreme was like the top then you got coconut and then you got almond crunch and you got cinnamon almost top tiers are apple pie lemon pie and uh and um I think strawberry cheesecake, if I remember. I like I like those. The ones that are kind of like average, you know, don't really stand out too much. But, you know, if you really are looking for that taste or whatever, peanut butter, uh, the, the chocolate, I mean the peanut butter, uh, peanut butter and jelly. That's pretty, it's decent. I ate a lot of this one. I, I, I ate actually too much of this one. But the mixed berry... Eh, it's okay. This is borderline banana nut muffin. Um, it just it just tastes like a burnt banana nut muffin. It's, it's 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 okay, but it's definitely not worth buying. By far, the two worst Quest Bar flavors. Like I would highly recommend staying away from anything chocolate. I don't know about the cookie dough flavor, but both their chocolate peanut butter and their um. Chocolate brownie are disgusting. Nastiest, the nastiest shit I've ever tasted in my entire life. I highly recommend staying away from it. It's not worth your time. Um, it's not worth. It's definitely not worth the money. But those, those, those four that I listed, the you know almond, the almond crunch, the uh, cinnamon, I mean cinnamon roll, the coconut, and the uh, peanut butter supreme. Yeah, thumbs up. Those are definitely worth the money. Only problem I think with these is, um, you know, they're um, they're good. You know, don't get me wrong, but just like you only would eat one of these a day. You know what I'm saying? Like anybody that eats a lot of these, either I don't know, like either they're sugar addicted, sugar addicted, or you know. I don't know, like, cause I watched Bios three do a review on these, and he was talking about how you know people are getting fat because you know these things lead you to overeating and Ugh. excuse me, yeah, they lead you to overeating and um, you know, um, I don't know, like I just I remember this video very vividly. He was saying, well, not vividly, but very vaguely. He was saying how, like, these contribute to, you know, people gaining weight because, you know, they cause you to overeat because of the sugar and stuff that's in them. But honestly, these would be, like, a deterrent. Like, it's, like, if if I ate, like, one of these a day, not only would my sugar craving be, be gone, but, like right, like, right now, I don't even feel hungry. Like, I'm just, like, and I just ate, like, you know, a tiny piece from each. So that, that kind of equates to, like, one bar. So... You know, I don't really feel hungry, so the, the the fiber that's in it and, you know, whatever else is in it, um, it really kind of sticks to your stomach. And, um, 
you know. And like I said, the sticky consistency, like this isn't the consistency of like a, like a bar that you would buy in a store that you know is full of sugar or, um, or you know, isn't what they say is in it. Like this is, has what it, they say it has in it. And it has that, you know, that natural smell to it. But um, it also, you can clearly tell that this was like, a, this was made through a scientific process. So, you know, it's, it's kind of like the best of both worlds. It uses natural ingredients, but the the manufacturing process is unnatural. So, Quest Bar, I'd say, overall, um, the flavors that I tried, the or the flavors that I just had, I would highly recommend the, my, like, the top ones, the ones that are 8s and 7s. Those I would recommend buying. The ones that are below, below a seven, I'd say, are like borderline. Like you really have to w crave that flavor to want to buy them. And they're chocolate. Stay away from their chocolate. They're cho like unless you like unless you like black coffee or like really 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 bitter tasting chocolate. I'm talking about I don't know like the darkest chocolate you can find in the store. If you like the if you like that, you'll love. The chocolate flavor but for me with my sensitive palate like it, I mean it almost made me gag it was just disgusting oh my god so overall I give quest bar a thumbs up but I also you know as, as far as like what everybody's told me um it's definitely they're definitely like not something I would run out and be like oh my god I gotta buy this oh my god I gotta try this like they're just they're they're okay they're not like you know, I thought there was going to be this revolutionary bar, <clears throat> but once I opened them, they're just like every other protein bar that I've tried. So, like I said, good going. Um, I know this video is dragged on. I'm rambling. You know, whatever. Put what you guys think about Quest Bars down into the comment section, and uh, let me know what you guys uh, think of the flavors that I've tried. If you tried them, if you haven't tried them, then what do you guys think of my review? Um, did it help you? Did it... Uh, Hurt, did it hurt your chances of buying <laughs> buying the Quest Bars? Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. And as always, down into the description is all of my social media links. So be sure to add your boy. But anyway, this is Elevation, a.k.a. Fastest Sith. Be good or be good at it, bitches. Sorry for the long video, but I will see you in the next one.